Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play Paper Mario. I am Fiery Red Hair. Wait, and I'm being very quiet because Peach told me that she wanted to take a nap. So we're actually gonna have to wait for another episode another time. Not really. You just leave Peach alone and she'll go to sleep, just like Mario. But she's not in the mood for napping today because we have to explore the castle. Yeah, this is very linear. You really don't have to collect anything. We just have to take care of one teensy weensy thing in this area. And then we'll be back over to Mario. But this one's kind of fun. I really like this part. Let's not get seen. Whoa. Dude. Go in here, which is normally in Super Mario 64 where Bomb Bomb's battlefield was. But in this case, it's not. <gasps> oh, it's Princess Peach. How'd she get out? King Bowser's really going to flip his wig if we don't take her back to her room. Now hang on just a second. Get a grip on yourself, okay? No need to panic. She can't get out of the castle anyway. And besides, what do you think about asking Princess Peach to participate in our little game? Should be ideal, and we need a third person. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah. You might be on to something. Okay, let's do it. Princess Peach, have you been listening? Come this way. We won't tell King Bowser about your escape if you help us with this little game we're playing. We're set up right over here. Well, then, at least your guards are dirt, you know, stupid, but... Oh, no! Princess Peach! The guards are stupid, but hey, at least they're nice. Koopa Corps presents the 64th Trivia Quiz Off. I'm your host, Mr. Hammer. Let's get right to it, hey? I'm going to ask you 10 questions of the contestants who get the most right is the winner. Press A when you think you know the answer, okay, folks? The winner will get a gorgeous, fabulous prize. Good luck to all of you. And I got to tell you. We're also giving prizes just for participating, so everybody will be a winner. That's just the kind of show we are. Ready? Question one. What's the name of the boss inside the volcano Lava Island? We already know that. Lava Piranha. Yeah, Goompa. That's correct. Let's go on to the next question, okay? Question two. Where did Master Huff and Puff imprison the Star Spirit? Flower Fields. We haven't been there yet, but it's pretty much a tip-off where we're going to be next. Okay, next. Question three. What is the name of the scary round master living in Dry Dry Ruins? Chumpy. You've still got a chance to make a comeback. Yeah, right. Question four. Get the flower... Dude! Passing through the flower gate. Oh, man. It's still anyone's game! Question five. What's the name of the person King Bowser really loves? Princess Peach! Yeah, if you didn't know that by now, Peach, you're really dense. Careful now. Question six. What's the most deeply related to Flower Fields? And you totally took that from me. Is next question an easy one? That's... And I did not read that shit. I just totally guessed there. Okay. Think carefully now. Question eight. What's the name for the ghosts who live in a round forever forest? Booze. Use your memory on this one. Question nine. What's the name of the area? Just go south of post office in Toad Town. I believe it's the flower garden. Now for the final question. Stay calm, everyone. Question ten. Where is Peach's castle now? On Bowser's castle. That's correct. Yay! So the 64th trivia quiz off has ended in great success. The winner is, wow, our unexpected guest, Princess Peach. Congratulations, Peach. Here's your prize. Yay, we get another jam and jelly. 
Thanks for coming, everyone. It's been grand. We'll see you at the next trivia quiz off. Oh, Princess Peach, I almost forgot. Here's your prize for participating. Sneaky parasol. A fabulous parasol given to quiz show participants. This is a sneaky parasol. If you face someone and press B, you can transform into that person. You just have to promise not to use it to sneak around. I mean, nobody would know you were Princess Peach. Imagine. Sorry for giving you such a little prize, Princess. <laughs> hey, it's only a prize for participating, so what'd you expect? I think that's better than jam and jelly. That's just me. Huh? What are you all doing? Hey, it looks like fun. I'm gonna join in. What? You already finished? Oh, I'm all rotten luck. Gah! Princess Peach, what's she doing here? She sneaked out again. Grr! You! Take Princess Peach back to her room. Now! Yes, sir! Sorry, Princess Peach. No! You backstabbers. Oh, woe is me. My beautiful treasure. Listen to you. My No treasure in the world is more valuable than life. Be thankful you escaped. You tell him. To think, this island was put in terrible peril because of the meddling of Bowser's men. I think it will work out okay. The eruption will subside, and Lava Lava Island will be just the same as it used to be. But... <sighs> Dear Mario, you have saved five of us star spirits now. Just a few more to go. My name is Miss Star. Let me grant you power that will help you along. Mario's star energy goes up to five, and you can now use Smooch, a new star spirit power. With Smooch, you can restore Mario's HP. I have to go back to Star Haven for now, but if you need me, please call on me at any time. Oh, I'm sure you'd like that, so you can Smooch in. I will be watching you and wishing for your success. I know you'll, be the, you'll see the princess soon enough, Mario. Have faith. Thank you again for saving me. See you soon. Okay, so it's legal for him to cheat on Peach now with that smooch move. That that That's awesome. Oh, I was so close. The treasure, right there. And then you... Then to get saved and yelled at by some sort of blooming great starfish. Aww. Still, dude. You got your priorities in the wrong order. But... I believe I did see the treasure chest fall somewhere in the jungle. And if I called it the desert in the last episode, I'm just gonna kick myself here. Well, he doesn't seem to be looking around anymore, but then again, he doesn't see what he didn't see what we saw. So let's go look for it. We had to come back anyway. To get that blooming thing. Wait, is it even here in that one or is it over here? Nope, it's right here. A volcano vase. Alright. Well, that'll make him happy. But let's go see if we can get that seed. Because we need it for the next chapter. Oh, hello. How are you doing? What? You want that seed? Oh, I completely forgot you. I just gave it to a guy named Colorado or something. What? Sorry about that. I'm so generous that I just have to give something to everyone. I'm generous too, dude, but seriously, when you promise something to somebody? Come on now. Okay, don't go under there. Oh well, we have something to give him anyway, so he'll be more than happy to trade for it, I'm sure. So let's get out of this jungle once and for all. All right, fork over the seed, man. And I'll give you this. Mario, good heavens, it's the treasure. How on earth did you? Well, I suppose that's of no con con consequence right now. You're giving it to me? Yep. You, you're giving it to me? Oh, glory, marvelous. 
dear man, you are, sim you are quite simply the cat's meow. Cheers. Yes, hmm, I suppose. It's only proper that I give this to you as thanks. We get the seed, yay. A bubble gave it to me while I was off exploring. I suppose it's quite a viable seed, but I'm not interested in it at all. Now that I've got the treasure, I proclaim this adventure to be a complete success. What a stupendous expedition. It will be forever recorded in the history of archaeology. Well, oh boy, let's away. Back to Toad Town with us. That we can. Don't believe there's much else to do here. Even though I would love to just sit here on the beach forever, we have to leave, which makes me kind of sad. And I'm totally going to ignore you guys. Yeah, you guys just... No. I, I'll, ta I'll, you know, I'll take it a fair trade to leave the beach if I don't have to deal with you guys. Oh well, Mario, old boy. Certainly you took your time, eh? Let's head back together. Hmm? Do you want to go back to Toe Town? That we do. What a heady adventure. I do love a lover island. Perchance someday I shall return to your shores. <gasps> What? You mean to tell me that you swam all this way? <sighs> yes, I <sighs> did it. I swam all the way. All right, Mario. Now I'm going to give you a beating you'll never. What? Wait, where are you going? Wait, Mario, wait up. Come back here, you chicken. Shoot. I'm sorry, that's just so funny. You swam all the way across the flippin' ocean just so you could fight me. When you could have just sat on the beach and waited. Get him, Seagull. And you're just gonna not. You're gonna ignore him. Oh well. Now we're back in the peaceful port. That again sounds like a bathtub. Yay! Thank heavens we've arrived. Now tuna ferrying is one experience I shan't do again. Cheers for the ride, though. I mean your debt. For now, I'm heading back to Koopa Village to relax. My wife must be waiting for me. Perhaps our paths will cross again in the future, old boy. Cheerio! Oh my god, do we really have to deal with you right now? I will never swim again for the rest of my life. Now, Mario, you're mine this time. Aya! Dude, maybe you should take a rest. Here it comes. You you better be ready. Oh no! All that swimming! My HP is almost gone! Well, I'll make it up for my low HP by using my new skills. Check this out! More power! Oh god. I know all of your fighting patterns now, Mario. See my gear? The spike? The wings? You can't attack me now. I'm the smartest fighter alive. I can't be defeated. Wahaha! I know there's a way to beat him, and I'm just not thinking of it at the time. Because I probably don't have my spike shell badge on, do I? Nope. Oh well, let's see. Hmm. I could do soul support you, so ha! Yeah, what in the- I didn't think you'd do that! Is that even legal? Yeah, it is legal. So I'm just gonna have to use a star storm on you. I'm, I'm just not. I don't even know right now what I could be doing. But whatever works, right? Alright, seven power. Damn, I blocked you. You still do five damage? 
Some last squirt should do it. If I didn't let go at the last second. I have nothing really to do, so I'm just gonna have to wait. There's probably a better way to do this, but I just don't know off the top of my head. There we go. Well, I wouldn't have been able to do it anyway, I don't think. Unless it was, like, right at the top. And we get 23 star points. And it was made a lot easier because he swam his way... He swam his way out of energy. Oh, you know what? Now that I think about it... I have wings! If I had just left Flown to the island, I wouldn't have wasted my HP. Then I probably would have beaten Mario in no time. Stupid, stupid, stupid. <sighs> yeah. Punishment. Ah! Yeah. But now that that's over, I'm going to end this here, and I will see you guys in the next episode. So, peace out.